Well, guys, it's live stream day. We've come in a little bit later because it's getting colder and colder in the studio and it does get a little bit hard to work when it's so cold. So what we tend to do is we do a little bit at home, various social media stuff. You creatives out there, you know all about that. Got to be on social media, you know that. You've got to keep doing it. So we do a bit of that and then we come in ready and get prepped for live stream. As you can see though, a little bit dark in here now. Uh, time being, what are we at? 20 past four. Yeah, 6.9 degrees. It hasn't changed since yesterday. It's, it's going to sit around that and get colder. It, do, it won't get much warmer than that in here. So what we tend to do is just say, right, we'll uh, come in later and do a bit on the computers and then come in and start on the live stream. There you go. Dude. Let there be light. Dude, we've got a problem. What's that? We're out of coffee. No! <laughs> Time to get prepped. Now we have been uh, a little, a little bit uh, slack. Oops, knocking the camera. A little bit slack, Harry, because we've just been chatting. But hey, we can have at least a, an hour off every now and then, can't we? No, we can't. So I'm going to clear this out. Um, it's from last week's, and uh, get set up for this week's. Right guys, so we've just got the table set up and leveled. I uh, we'll always keep the big level just over there. So that's good, because I do need to keep this level for tonight, because I'll be doing quite a fluid technique. And I don't want it all disappearing off over there, which is where most things disappear when we don't use the table. Good. So we've got the tripod over there. That's going to have the battery and the center receiver unit for Roam Cam. If you've never seen one of our broadcasts before, do go check them out. I'll pop a link down below to all the live streams. Over 100 of them now. So we've got all the wireless tech for that. I'm busy just going through some of the paints I'm going to need for tonight on my lovely clean bench. <laughs> Might even break out the compressor. Who knows? But we've got the thinners underneath. Brand new dustbin this week. Hooray! I've got my lappy open, ready to look at the broadcast, how it's streaming. Most importantly, I've got my chat box up so I can chat to everybody. Uh, a few more bits and pieces. The trusty tripod that we're going to broadcast to Instagram on. And hopefully, if AD can work his magic, we will be broadcasting onto Facebook as well. But right now, he's just going to set up the stream. We're looking at the streaming software. Where's the corner cam? You can see all that in position now. So we've done all the levelling, all the straightening up and all the tests. Time for me to get in my paint clothes. we've created the most sensational, colourful, flowing, epic, beautiful, expressive, deep, rich and powerful piece of art I think we've created for some time. I'm excited about it. I know you can tell. Anyway, folks, that's it from us for tonight. Thank you so much for watching and a very good night from Suarez HQ. We're officially out of here. Right, well, that's me shut down. Well, that was an epic live stream. Hell of a painting, that was. I think uh, Ed's just... Switching lights on, switching lights off. Not sure where he's gone. Oh, there he is, switching lights off in there. Yeah, there he is. Right, I'll get you to zip that one, buddy, yeah. if you would. Right. Dark, cold. Lots of ones from last week. Just, we only just pulled them out because they are literally still drying for seven days. And they're still not dry. So. A lot of paint went onto them. Right, yeah, dark out there. Gonna get locked and loaded. I'm gonna head home. Right, guys. Okay, we're gonna start another day. Now, 
<clears throat> did a couple of paintings a few weeks ago. Whoop, as I dropped that on the live stream. That's one of them there. And the other one just behind me, that one there. A little bit experimental as far as we're concerned because I did it on, well, it's a bit like all these pouring videos you see across across YouTube and the internet and people just pour stuff. And of course it's a bit different for us because we're using enamel paint and it doesn't react like uh, uh, acrylic paints like everybody else. Anyway, uh, we did three on the night. I'll put a link in description. aidy has got the first one, which is here, which was the smaller one. Uh, these colors look amazing. So we're just gonna pop this down. Now, let me explain the reason why we got wood on the floor. This is just to raise the canvas off the uh, cold concrete, especially this time of the year, just to allow a little bit of air to get underneath and circulate. And this is an 80 centimeter square. Did it on a pre-stretched canvas, which for the eagle eyed amongst you will know, we don't normally do that kind of thing. So that's why now we're just propping it up. Uh, it just helps in the curing process. And then we can get, on, the air can go underneath as well as hit it on top. Um, it just helps the enamel paint cure a little bit quicker. So we're gonna get the other two in as well, move them out of here. And a couple of the bits and pieces to move around because we've got visitors on Monday. Um, right, let's get on. We are just about to get the Patreon paintings into the jiffy bags and get sent off. So we've just got to check now and make sure that he gets the correct serial numbered ones to the correct people. Yeah, so we've got them. one, two, three and seven today. It's one, it's two, three, and four, five, seven. six. Seven is the top corner one, should be seven. Let's check, eh? Yeah, let's check. Yep, yeah, we've seven. Da 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 Right, so here we are, busy backing up the first of the Patreon paintings. So they're getting their unique uh, hand-painted one of 102, complete with unique serial number on the back. And the plate stand. And look how good they look on a rotating base. So I've just done photographs. I'm gonna go and get the certificates ready now. And then we're gonna shoot a little welcome video for each individual one. How awesome is that? Look, how cool is this for personal touches? AD has now used all of his easy, rather extensive artistic confidence to do a little smiley face. <laughs> my fab to that poor chap. <laughs> uh, on each of the, play of the stands that goes with it. What a nice little touch, look. I just hope the people receiving these don't think it's a self-portrait -port of them. <laughs> but they're brilliant, look at that. There, look, and you end with a happy one. Look at that, isn't that marvellous? Well done, mate. I'm out of a job all of a sudden. Uh -huh. <laughs> right, guys, we've just uh, come into the pod. First time we've seen the painting we did from the live stream on Wednesday. And I'll say, this is utterly incredible. Yeah. Have you got the switch there, buddy? Uh -huh. Do you want to kill the light? There we go. Now I just put the light in, just because of the cameras that we're filming on. Doesn't like too much light. How about that? Is that not the most amazing, rich, delicious, opulent, colourful, happy thing you've ever seen? And like I say, we created this live. I'll put a link down in the description so you can go and see the live stream for yourself. It was an epic night. We were just saying, me and AD, that there is no one else out on the internet doing anything like this. Certainly not doing it live, but this is how good we are. And uh, I like to blow our own trumpet once in a while, but that is spectacular. Let me give you a few close-ups and see what I mean. So there we go, guys. Another epic success. 
from the weekly live stream broadcast. We'd love to see you on the next one. We're at 7.30 p.m. GMT every Wednesday live from Suarez HQ. We'll hope to see you then.